Our other top story tonight, Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis is now defending the special prosecutor overseeing former President Donald Trump and his allies' election interference case amid allegations that the two are having an improper relationship. God, you never told me that on Christmas night 2023 that I would get an emergency call from Capers Green, my chief of investigations. The police are surrounding your house. A man has called 911 and he said he shot a woman in the head. I am headed there. You never told me the pure, unimaginable fear as I believe my oldest child was dead in my home. And this is just the first time that Fulton County District Attorney Fonny Willis has spoken publicly since the bombshell allegations of an improper relationship with special counsel surfaced. Willis spoke to a church congregation that was her there from the pulpit this morning defending her office. Atlanta News First reporter Bridget Spencer reports. It was a music-filled celebration by Martin Luther King Jr. at Atlanta's oldest black church, Big Bethel AME. And the speaker of the hour, Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis. I hope for y'all this week, I don't look like what I've been through. Willis speaking publicly since bombshell allegations of an improper relationship with her special counsel on the Trump election interference case, Nathan Wade. Willis taking the opportunity to defend her office, however, never confirming nor denying the allegations. I hired one white woman, a good personal friend and great lawyer, a superstar, I tell you. I hired one white man, brilliant, my friend and a great lawyer. And I hired one black man, another superstar, a great friend, and a great lawyer. Oh Lord, they gonna be mad when I call them out on this nonsense. Willis also spoke about the countless death threats she says she receives, and also shared some words about U.S. Rep. Marjorie Taylor Greene. Dear God, I do not want to be like those that attack me. I never want to be a Marjorie Taylor Greene, who has never met me but has allowed her spirit to be filled with hate. Faith leaders at the service say Big Bethel is a safe haven for leaders like Willis. She's constantly under threat. <laughs> Reputation constantly attacked. Yes, yes, under constant criticism. Yes. But she keeps on doing her job. In Atlanta, Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News First. Now the judge overseeing Georgia's election subversion case against former President Donald Trump and others has set a hearing to discuss those allegations of an improper relationship. That hearing is planned for early February.